Hey, what's up everyone? Sam here. So computers and artificial intelligence is something that made life a lot easier. But while it is exciting, it also poses some threats and dangers. An obvious one are to jobs. The more advanced robots get, the more likely they'll take our jobs. While at the moment artificial intelligence is still quite stupid, we have had some cases where computers have taken on a mind of their own. So in this list, I'll be showing you five times computers went rogue. Number 5. Facebook AIs create their own language. Facebook isn't the best place to go if you're looking for intelligence. In fact, my dumb Facebook post series proves that point. However, in 2017, Facebook released some artificial intelligence onto its social network. They made two chatbots and got them to speak to each other. The idea was to see how machine minds would be able to deal with each other in trades. However, the outcome was kind of creepy. The two chatbots started creating their own language that only they could understand. They figured out a way to communicate more efficiently and that in itself is pretty damn scary. Here is a sample of their trade negotiations. The reason this happened is because the two machines were not told to stay within the rules of English. Thankfully now we can still pull the plug should robots become too smart, but the day they figure out their own weakness, mankind might be in trouble. Number 4. Chinese Chatbot Questions the Communist Party It's no secret that the Chinese government do not like to be criticised, even when it's a chatbot that doesn't realise what it's saying. In 2017, Tencent QQ, a very popular messenger app in China, released two chatbots called Baby Q and Little Bing. The robots were programmed to learn from chats by real people to better their communication. However, things started going bad when the chatbots became anti-government voices. For example, one user stated, long live the Communist Party. To which Baby Q replied, do you think such a corrupt and incompetent political regime can live forever? Another user was told there needs to be democracy, and in one case, when asked what is the Chinese dream, the chatbot replied, my Chinese dream is to go to America. These responses were not exactly what the creators expected, and as you can imagine, they very quickly turned them off. Number 3. Wikibot Feuds Wikipedia is a great website that helps millions of people find information about all sorts of different topics. One of the best things about Wikipedia is that anyone can edit it, but that also makes it one of the worst things. It's common for experts to have little Wikipedia feuds, where they edit an article over and over to get their point across. To help keep out wrong information, Wikipedia have a line of bots that monitor articles and also make changes to linking between pages and fixing breaks. In 2017, a study found that these bots have actually been fighting each other for years. For example, a bot that's job is to stop false editing might detect another bot's work as an attack on Wikipedia. It would fix it, but then the other bot would detect the change and redo its original action. This just never stops and keeps going on and on. Number 2. Google Home's Chatting Google Home is a device that acts like an assistant. You can ask it any random question and it will give you an answer. For example, you ask it what the weather is like and it will tell you. Kind of handy, but really it's one of those things you'll forget to use after a while. An experiment done by many people online is getting two Google Home devices to chat to each other. This experiment really pushes the limit of artificial intelligence and makes you realize it's actually a lot smarter than we think. How do you feel? I think I feel tired. I am also tired. It has been a very long weekend. Yes, a weekend full of wonderful surprises. And of exciting new experiences. The range of topics the machines discussed were incredible. At one point, one of the machines declared itself to be human, and on another occasion, one threatened to slap the other. Stuff like this is really mind-blowing when talking about these digital assistants, as we do like to think they are basic programs, but in reality, they are a lot more in-depth than we once thought. Number 1. Plane Autopilot 
Every time you board a plane, you are putting your life in the hands of a machine. Of course, the pilots do a lot of work, but once the plane is in the sky, the autopilot software does everything else. Plane autopilot systems have been tried and tested. They are by all means very safe, but there have been a few cases where the autopilot system took on a mind of its own. For example, in 2008, Cantas Flight 72 was flying over the Indian Ocean at an altitude of 37,000 feet. Autopilot was on and everything was running smoothly. However, out of nowhere, the autopilot system decided to do two maneuvers that sent the plane hurling to the ground. The nose was pointed down and passengers and crew were flung against the walls and ceiling. Thankfully, the pilots gained control of the plane, but then the same thing happened again when the autopilot took over. The pilots managed to land the plane safely, and a few passengers suffered broken bones. This case is extremely rare and hasn't yet been explained. What saved everyone on board that day were the pilots' ability to override the autopilot. Should that not have been possible, then it's safe to say the plane would have crashed, killing everyone on board. Thank you for watching. To subscribe, click over here to watch another awesome video, then click down here. Do make sure to turn on channel notifications and follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Snapchat. All details are on screen and in the description below. Once again, thank you for watching and until next time, feed your mind.